Barakathu Yehawa Ba'asham Yehawa Shai Barakathu Yehawa Ba'asham Yehawa Shai Barakathu Yehawa Ba'asham Yehawa Shai Ba'asham Rekha Kudash Give double honours to our teachers of Great Millstone Peace and salutations to our sincere brothers pushing his truth throughout the four corners of the earth risking their lives <coughs> week in and week out to feed the lost sheep of Israel. And as always, Shalom to the hopeful elect. This is just a short encouragement message to the governing body of men. Because you know what time it is. Oh yes, you definitely know what time it is. Alright? Sometimes you feel cut down. But through the spirit of Yahweh Basham Yahushai, you was meant to feel cut down. Because the Lord's purpose is to bring you down, to put you, bring you back up again. That's the Lord's purpose. To make you stronger. The book of Proverbs 24 verse 16. For a just man falleth seven times. It's all about that completion. The governing body of men. It's all about that completion. When you feel cut down. Just know that you're going to be brought back up again. You see, the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. It is their time to rule. But when, they be, when they're going to be cut down for good, they'll stay down. The elect, there's a difference with the elect. The elect is put down to be brought back up again. There's a difference. For a just man falleth seven times. And riseth up again. But the wicked shall fall into mischief. You see the difference? Alright, you, you brothers, you know what time it is. First Timothy's 4 verse 14. To 16. And this is why when you feel cut down sometimes, remember this. Neglect not the gift that is in thee. Right? Although you're being cut down, never forget what is put in you. The gift. Neglect not the gift that is in thee, which was given thee by prophecy. With the laying on of the hands of the presbytery, which means that the elders, the priesthood. Here we go again. Meditate upon these things. Okay? This, this, this is just a reminder to the governing body of men. Meditate upon these things. Give thyself wholly to them. That thy profiting may appear to all. Okay? What you brothers are doing right now. From the apostles come right down. Don't worry, we are watching. Yeah, we see. Alright? We see the gift that you have. Do not neglect the gift. Take heed unto thyself. And unto the doctrine. It's all about that doctrine. Continue in them. Right? For in doing this, thou shalt both save thyself and them that hear thee. Neglect not the gift that is in thee.
the book of Job, chapter 14. Seeing his days are determined, the number of his months are with thee. Thou hast appointed his bounds that he cannot pass. You know what time it is, yeah? You know what time it is. Turn from him that he may rest till he shall accomplish as an hireling his day. For there is hope of a tree if it be cut down. You see, there's a difference be between the, the, the godly and the ungodly. When they're cut down, they're going to stay down for good. But with the righteous, they are upright. They are meant to cut down, to come back up again strong. Kwam Yashorala. For there is hope of a tree. If it be cut down, that it will sprout again. A seven, a, a just man, an upright. Oh, let me say it again before I forget. In the Proverbs. For a just man falleth seven times. Seven times. And riseth up again. Because he's meant to be put down, to be brought back up again. That's the elect. Because the more he's put down, he comes back stronger and stronger. For there is hope of a tree, if it be cut down, that it will sprout again. That's the elect. And that the tender branch thereof will not cease. You see what I'm saying? It will not cease. So remember again, you are meant to feel this way. You are meant to feel this way. But you're going to rise. And when and this time when you rise, it's going to be forever. Forever and ever. Amen. Shalom.